Right then, this is a quick walk around video, and this is for a Honda Civic 1.8 EX. Uh, it's a manual car with 68,000 miles on the clock, and it's been very, very well maintained and looked after. Uh, it comes with three lovely options fitted to it as well, actually. Um, notably, you've got a lovely black leather interior with heated seats, uh, big glass panoramic roof, and rear parking sensors, so someone spent some money in exactly the right way on the car. It's very, very, very nice. Front end of the car, very clean. Only the tiniest amount of stone chipping. Far less than you'd normally expect to see on this age of mileage of car. And let's come down the near side first, which is really very, very clean indeed. There is one minor indentation on this car, which I will show you, because it's the whole point of doing it. Um, near side front alloy, really, really clean. And then the panels. Really, very, very good indeed. This side rear alloy, again, very good. But just above the wheel arch there, you can just see there is a little indentation. Um, it is minor, you could get it pulled out if you really wanted to. Um, but you know, honestly, it's an 11 year old car, you expect to see the odd very light mark. And this is minor indeed. Uh, but I am nitpicking, I did say, you know, the whole point of doing these. Come around the back of the car again, very, very clean and tidy. And then down the off side of the car, it's very, very smooth in the panels, really clean. The black suits the car absolutely beautifully. Off side rear alloy again, very, very nice indeed. And then the rounding panel work, really, really nice. And the final alloy there which is very very clean and tidy so externally it's in really good condition for the age manager vehicle coming to the back of the car now huge boots on these civics absolutely massive obviously you've got 60 40 fold on the rear seats there all in very very nice condition back here as well um worth pointing out you probably already know you do have this little cubby hole underneath there and if you give that a yank and drop it down you've got a good sort of seven or eight inches of extra boot depth as well Coming to the back of the car, all the door cards are in lovely condition. And the interior, again, is really, really nice on the car. As you can see there, black leather work is in very, very nice condition as well. Front passenger door card, again, beautiful condition, including all the little recesses. Passenger seat itself has been given minimal use in the long stay. The driver's car, driver's car, door card, even get spit, spit some out some, and again, lovely condition throughout. The air is all very clean and tidy. And the driver's seat itself has been kept wonderfully, wonderfully well. So, inside the car now, engine's running through this part of the video, so you can see the dashboard actually illuminated. And what a wonderful dashboard that it is! It looks absolutely stunning. See there, sat nav working absolutely perfectly, nice and high up. And then the controls for it, as you see on the EX with the big rotary control down there. But it's all been kept really, really, really nicely. If I pan back this way, that is the view you get as a driver of this fantastic dashboard. And that's pretty much where you want to set the driving position as well, with the steering wheel rim slap bang between the rev counter and the speedo above it. But there's nothing else in its class that looks quite like this um, which as I openly admit isn't for everybody but to me I think it's absolutely wonderful if I just pan in there for you hopefully you can see 68,001 miles no warning lights at all in the dashboard just to quickly show you owner's manual pack and lock and wheel nut key are here and present with the car so finally just to come under another beautifully presented Honda engine bay Fantastic engines, these they really are. Uh, just been serviced by ourselves. Um, cam chain driven, no cam belts on these at all, so no big services looming either.